Hey everyone, it's Laura Erdman Lentz here from the Simply Serendipity Leadership Team and I just wanted to do a super quick video today about joy oil. So joy, if you're not familiar with it, is it's a woodsy floral scent which actually research has found, sorry I have to smell it of course as I'm talking about, has found is, is the most uplifting of all aromas so it is aptly named. It is also an incredibly high vibratory oil which I've talked about before, I can talk about it again. Let me know if you have questions, I'll do another live stream. But just simply wearing it helps you feel better because of the vibration. The only oil that has a higher vibration than joy is rose oil, and actually rose is in here, but rose is twice joy. I mean, rose is a really potent, potent oil. But my funny story I wanted to share with you is Gary Young was, was talking about how people frequently ask him if if their oils are still good. You know, they've been on the shelf for three years. Is this, is it, is it still viable? And FYI, the answer is absolutely. These will probably be viable long after you're gone. You're going to be able to leave these to your kids and your grandkids. That, that's how, how great they are. They actually found viable essential oils in King Tut's tomb. So yes, they will be fine. But my funny story about Joy is he said, you know, I got someone who said, I've had joy oil on my shelf for three years. Is that good? And he goes, no, it's not good. You, you should be going, that means you're not using it. You should be going through a, a couple of bottles a month. You've got to be diffusing that and wearing it all the time. <laughs> so that's my funny story about joy oil. And I will tell you, I diffuse this now. After hearing that, I diffuse it pretty much every morning with a little bit of peppermint. So here's my morning diffuser almost every morning, unless there's something special going on and we need something else like a little thieves or something else. Um, it's joy and it's peppermint because that's a great way to start your day. Okay, I had a quick question. Um, do they stay good even when they're open? Yes, yes, yes. I've had oils now for three years and nothing has turned. The only thing is I will tell you citrus can because citrus is not distilled, it's expressed. So it can go but rancid, um, you'll know, it'll smell funny. I've never experienced it. A lot of people keep their citrus oil in the fridge. I do not, I've, I go through it relatively quickly. I've never had anything um, go rancid on me. So if you have any questions, post below. I'd love to hear your own joy stories. And thanks for joining me. Have a great day, everybody.